Hey everybody, it's Rav1, and I am here with, uh, as you saw in the description, a very office-centric pop video for you. I'm going to be showing you office pops that I got for my own personal collection, as well as some for resale. Um, but before we get into that, uh, if you enjoy our content, please make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. We appreciate all of our subscribers. We're uh, hoping for really big and awesome things this year in 2021 with you guys. Um, and also to hit that notification button. That way you guys can be notified when our videos go live, which is every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, and at the end of the video, if you enjoyed this one, please smash that like button. I really appreciate it. So yeah, Office Pops. Um, if you guys saw in the description, you guys see sitting right here. I actually have one that I'm not unboxing, and I'll, I'll explain why. I had gotten an Amazon package in about a week ago, and I could not find it on my orders list. I was dumbfounded. I was like, I don't know what this is. I, I can't find it. Like, literally, I went through my entire order history, and I could not find this. And I opened the box up, and lo and behold, inside were two of the Dundee Award Amazon exclusive pop, which I did order from Amazon back when they were first announced. Um, whenever the announcement date was, I was like, all right, I'm going to get at least two of these. I think that I'm not sure if there was a limit or not. If there was, that's why I only got two. But if there wasn't, I, I was like, I'm going to get one for myself and then one to one to resell. Um, but I could not find this on my Amazon list whatsoever. So it was, it was really weird. So I know I bought it, but it didn't show up on my order list. So that's why I opened the box up, and instead of doing the cheesy thing of retaping the box up and opening it up, I was just like, you know, I'm just going to put it in my pop protector, and then I'll show you guys that we got this one. So that's that's the first one that we got here. Um, the other th ones that we have, we have from the company Poppin' Off Toys. I think this... It's really heavy. I don't know how they package. Uh, I think this is the third series of the Office Pops, which we already own three of, but there's a fourth one that we don't know, which I think is in here. So there'll be three of these pops in here that are going to be for resale. And then this one is from calendars.com. And I do believe this is like four of the same pop in here, one for me to keep and then three to resell. So they'll be up on their eBay store. So we'll open up this one last and we'll do the popping off toys one first. Um, and again, the popping off toys, one, like I said, this just, just should be the series three pops that they came out with which is Dwight as the, the Scranton Strangler, um, Michael in the straight jacket. Um, oh, who's the third one? Um, oh, wait, hang on. It's on the back here. Oh, actually, I don't have two of these. Uh, Jim Halpert in here? Oh, no, I do have that one. That's the, the I think it's like six days um, without any nonsense. Uh, pop and then the Jan Levinson pop as well. Not Jan Levinson Gould, just Jan Levinson um, should be in this one as well. So ooh, popping off toys. Kudos on the packaging. Very nice. They actually have it double boxed, which I really appreciate. You know, some companies are great with pops, other companies not so much. Oh, and all of these pops are actually in pop protectors. So pretty impressed. And it looks like popping off toys has their own pop protector, which they put it in. That's pretty cool. So there's the Dwight Schrute as the Scranton Strangler. Again, we already own that guy, so that one will be right up on the eBay store. We have Michael Scott in the straight jacket. Again, already own that one. This one actually looks like it is bowed, though. I mean, not sure if you guys are seeing that, but I mean, it's let's take it out of the pop protector and see. Another one that I have is in pristine condition, so. Not just sure if it's the pop protector that's bowed or if it's the pop itself. Eh, not, not terrible. I don't know if I'd call it mint, but I mean, it's got a little bit of a bow on here because it almost looks like the plastic is hitting weird in here. Yeah, this one might need a little bit of opening up and some surgery on it just to see what's going on with that. Um, and if it's not terrible, I'll probably actually throw my more pristine one up on the eBay store and keep the one that's not as pristine. Because honestly, with my collection, I'm not planning on selling it anytime soon. So I don't mind if I keep ones that are not 100% mint in my own personal collection. Just because I'm a huge fan of The Office. So I want to keep all of those. Oh, that's cool. Popping off toys throws their business card right in there. It's cool. All right. So then we have, this is the Gym Pop. Yeah, this is the six days since our last nonsense pop. I'm pretty sure I already own this one as well. It's a cool pop though. 
So if I do own that one, you'll see that one on the eBay store as well, links down below. And then the last one, this one I definitely do not own because I haven't seen it yet, but this is Jan Levinson. Um, and she has her candle and her wine glass. Uh, if you remember, this is from the infamous episode, The Dinner Party, where Michael invited Pam and Jim and Andy and Angela, and then Dwight showed up and Dwight's nanny showed up and Jan and Michael got into an argument and <laughs> Jan threw um, Michael's Dundee through his plasma TV, which was like that big. But yeah, really cool. And then Jan's Candle Company, which they, you know, Michael was trying to get the boys to buy into. So cool pop. Um, first time they actually had a Jan Levinson pop out, so I was happy to get it. All right, so then this one here, this is from calendars.com. I think I remember which pop this is. I think this is the Michael Klump pop, but it may not be. So, it's a Michael pop of some sort. And there's an exclusive one. So, let's see. Michael... Oh, no, this is not the Michael Klump pop. pop. This one's almost better. Okay, there's only three pops in here. Lots of packaging. This is a good sign. Looks like the pops are in. I'll throw them out quick so you guys can't see them. You guys may have gotten a peek there. This is the one that I'm a little concerned about, so I'm taking a look at this one first. Okay, this one's got a little bit of bowing, but this will probably stay on my personal collection. So this is the Michael Starn pop. It's a. Was it only at Go, uh, which is part of Calendars.com. Um, they're exclusive. This is the Michael Scarn, uh, which was Michael Scott's um, movie that he made called Threat Level Midnight. Incredible episode. Um, really cool looking pop, too, with Michael as uh, Special Agent Michael Scarn. Uh, if you guys haven't seen The Office, that's a great episode. Uh, hilarious, hilarious episode. Also, too, which is cool, um, they actually had a Golden Face Jim pop out previous. I think that was actually first series of The Office was uh, Golden Face. And I actually have that one, so that'll pair up nicely with that. So, yeah, that's the haul. Um, you know, there's going to be, looks like uh, we already have the Dundee uh, one on our eBay store. Um, looks like we're going to have three more of the Series 3 Office Pops and two Michael Scarn Pops up there for you as well. So if you're interested in any of those, check the link down below for the eBay store. So, yeah, that's uh, that's the Office unboxing. Uh, more stuff from my collection. I always keep one of them for my own. Um, I'll actually put a picture of my collection in this video. It'll probably be here or there or somewhere now. And you guys can see all the Office Pops I have. I have quite a bunch of them. Um, see, I'm a huge Office fan. And I'm a huge Pop fan. So, I'm rambling. I'm going to stop doing that. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, smash that like button, like I said earlier. And as always, stay safe out there. Bye.